Hi friends, Karen Vizueta, how are you? Today we're doing a full body stability ball workout. You need a light set of dumbbells. We're gonna do some Pilates inspired moves throughout our workout today. So let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna lie down on our back and I want you to place the heels right on top of the ball. Notice you're about a 90 degree angle here with your hip, knee and ankle joint. Inhale with thumbs up position. We're gonna roll the ball away. On your exhale, I want you to draw the navel to spine, peeling the knees back. And again, inhaling. Think of that deep core turning on. You get a little hamstring recruitment. Four more here for four. Exhale, bring it in. And three. Two more here. Two, we're just warming it up. One to the finish. And one, placing the palms down, heels stay on top of the ball. Now take that breath as you inhale. Use your exhale, draw the belly button into imprint. Make sure you're squeezing the butt. We're gonna rise up to a bridge, holding on top for one. Using your exhale, melting down vertebrae by vertebrae. Let's do that again. Those hamstrings say hello. Draw the navel. Make sure you're squeezing the buttocks here. Turn on that seat. Rising up. Holding for one. And then slowly return that back down. Now we're going to do a little more movement here. If this ever gets too much, I just want you to stay on the floor. Okay? Inhale one. Scooping the abdominals. Squeeze the buttocks. Rising up. We're going to roll out. Roll in. We hover our bridge and squeeze. Roll out, roll in, hover, fire the glutes and lift. Inhale, exhale, roll. My hamstrings are warming up here, pressing out, return, drop. Let's do one more to the finish. Feeling those glutes turning on, lifting up and lower back down, taking the arms overhead. Chin is off chest, rolling the legs out. This time on the inhale, nodding the head. On the exhale, we're coming up into that curl and lengthening the legs out. Chin is off that chest, lifting up, gazing toward the belly and returning. Four more here, pressing for four. Lengthen away. Exhale, pressing for three. Two more to the finish. Exhale, we have two. Here is your last one, rising up to that curl, holding here. Now we're gonna roll the legs out, stay in the curl, reach the arms and peel in. Inhale away, exhale, peel in, four more. This feels too much to stay in flexion, head is down. And three, there it is, you have your two, belly is burning, and one. Low the ball, roll it out. Left leg lengthens up, flex that foot, point down to the top. Now, as we flex up, I want you to press that right glute down into the ball. So we're activating the posterior, the back of that right leg. Four more. Three. Make sure it's in the glute, not in the knee joint. Last one. And switch. Left foot is on the ball. Right leg comes up. Lower down. X. Lower down. That seat. Good, good. Finish. Three to finish. Two more. Here it is. Last one and lower that down. Now, both feet, heels pressing in. On the glutes, draw the belly in. Squeeze the buttocks, rising up. Hip lift, lower down. Exhale, turning on that deep core. Fire the seat. Lift up, up, up. And come down. Let's try that again. Inhale. Exhale. And one more to the very end. Draw the waistline, fire your seat, lifting up, holding up, and then take that down. Heels together, toes apart, frog leg in, and extend out. Heels are squeezing. Now, listen to my change. Hands gently behind the head, stay in flexion. Point the toes and flex and point and flex, we're adding on, get ready, four, flex in, three, bring it in, two, now hold out on one, you're gonna lift the right leg, lower, frog legs, return, lift the left leg, inner thigh, frog legs, return, lift, lower, pull it in, return, lift, 
lower. We have one more on each side. Lift, lower, one more. Finish strong, lift, lower, and roll that in. Way to work. Taking the ball to the hands here. Making sure the palms are on the outside. We're gonna reach the arms and legs over on the inhale, bend the knees, exhale, lift up to the curl. Now balancing the ball right there, try not to let it move and come up. So when that ball stays there, it ensures that those legs are staying tabletop. And we're really using our abdominals here to lower. Otherwise, if we move the legs, the ball's gonna fall, right? Inhale, exhale. So we gotta go slow, we gotta find balance, slow. It is burning, lift up, overhead, balance, one more to the finish, how are we feeling, and hold, lower that down, control, here is our change, you're going to come back up, now extend the leg straight, taking the right hand onto the ball, left hand onto the ball, and then left leg, and left arm, lower, Right arm, right leg, lower, bring it in. Inhale, exhale, there it is. Four more, we're doing same side, four. Feeling that waist, three, two, and one, holding onto the ball. Straight arm and leg. Now the ball is really weighted on that top, lifting up ball to the shins. So it challenges that core right there. Adding on, inhale, lift the legs, reach through for four, legs together, lower down and hover. Bend the knees if this feels too much, three. Or option one without opening the legs to abduction. Two, one more to the finish, and we rest. Roll up to seated, that was excellent. Now, we have our light set of dumbbells here. What I want you to do is coming into this position where we're prone. Toes are onto that mat, right? So that's gonna keep us nice and still. Arms are out to the side. Make sure we're not overextending. The gaze is down. <sighs> Flying those arms out. Exhale, draw the waistline in. Glutes are squeezing. Middle upper back, rear delts are firing. Eight more. Maybe you're doing this without a load today, right? Six. Three pounds here is a nice option. Four, so we're making sure we're not getting anything into the neck. Two more here. Maybe we did an extra one, that's okay. Last one, and bring those weights in, right to the side of the rib cage. Extend back, return, extend, squeeze, fire, back of those arms. Eight, seven, Six, burning, five, four more here, four, three, we're feeling triceps, yes, two, love it, love it, hold, come in an inch, pulse, seven, now try not to let the ball move, six, five, my arms are on fire, three, two, one, and rest. Nice work, coming down here with hands on the ball. Slight micro bend to your elbows, shoulders off. The ball should not be moving as we progress through this exercise. Taking that breath. Exhale, scooping the navel, fire the glutes, lift up, but I want you to pause. I want you to make sure you're not leaning into this too far forward and you're not getting in the low back. So come up, think more length, fire the glutes, and lower. Lift, 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 turn on your seat, come down. We have four more, rising up, four, lower down, three, lower down, two more here, two, one more to the finish, here's your one, and return. Now for the next exercise here. I want you to bend your, el your knees in so your heels are together. Give it a squeeze, let the knees drop. Heel squeeze prone, we're gonna lift and hug the ball. Squeeze, return. Six to the finish. Five. We got four more here, four. Turning on that seat. 
Two more. Last one and pulse up an inch. Small. Six, five, four, three. Shoulders are stable. And one. Lengthen that away. All right, I'm going to get the dumbbells out of the way. Starting on the ball here, and we're going to walk out. Maybe we're here today just holding that plank. If you can, you're going to come out a little bit further, right? The lower the ball is on the legs, the more challenging the exercise is. Rolling the ball in and releasing. 10. Little knee stretch. 9. Stay long. 8. 7. 6 more here. Lengthen away. 5. We got four more. Four options, modifications, or holding plank. Two more. Two. And one. And come off the side of the ball. Way to work. All right, what I want you to do now is take both weights to the right hand. The knees are bent. The elbow is going to be on the ball supporting. And we're going to come down into a bicep curl. So we have an assisted bicep curl. Notice if this load feels too heavy, just adjust. Keep that control. Four more here. Four. Three. Two. One. Switch it up. Elbow in, shoulders neutral, lower down. All right, so we got a little support with that arm on the ball. So we're isolating that tricep. Eight more. Eight. Seven. Making sure we're not swinging from the elbow joint. Four more. Four. Three. Two. And one. All right, listen, we're going to grab a seat on the ball. So right on top, center position. Lift the heart and chest. We don't want to collapse down into this. Side raise. Lift it up. Six more here. Six. Sit tall. Five. Four. Three. Who's ready? Now we're going to go into scaption. 45 degrees. So you have a low V. High V up. You can go a little bit higher here. Think middle upper back helping to keep that control. Keeping that posture tall, right? Three more here. Three. Now your last set. You're going right in to that front raise. Coming down, front raise up. Good, right to the finish. Six. Four more, four, three, feeling those arms, two, and one. Awesome job coming onto the ball. Now, we want to make sure that our head is rested on the ball and the head is not hanging off. So, we're going to walk this forward, squeeze the buttocks. Glutes are engaged, elbows out to the side, chest press up and down. Glutes are continuously engaging. Core is being challenged here. Four. Three. Two. Hold on one. Flip your grip. Open. Hug it in. Good. Chest fly. Five more here. Hug it up for five. Four, three, keeping those glutes working, two, how are we doing, one. Now, let go of the load here. We're going to make sure here the small of the back is on the ball. Elbows behind the head, fingertips soft. Lift up for two and lower down. Exhale, curl for two, inhale, lower down. Feet don't want to move here, right? The ball doesn't want to go forward or back. Everything is controlled. Single set. Eight. Seven. Six. 
five, four more, four, three, get ready, two, here's your one. Now, scoop into the ball, we're gonna twist over to the left side. We're gonna come up an inch and down an inch and six. Think of the rib coming to the hip. Four more, four, you feel that? Three, two, one, twist and twist and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, back to center, bring the hands together, shoulders off the ears, we're gonna scoop into the ball, lift up, belly should be burning, who is ready? We're gonna bring the arms overhead, chop forward, right? Not changing position of the head and the neck. Now let's go to the right. We're gonna go right and left, making a little arch. Right, up and around, left. Four more, four, three, two, Stay center on your last one and pulse up an inch. Seven, we're not using those arms. Six, now do me a favor, press into the palms a little bit more and feel the belly engage. Three more, three. Exhale, two, exhale, one. And my friends, we are done. I wanna thank you so much for joining me. Grab a seat nice and tall. Taking one arm over, side bend for this short, super efficient stability ball workout. Save it, use it again. Perfect for after some cardio or if you're in a time sensitive situation where you need to get that workout in, it's the perfect way to go. All right, listen, if you're looking for a program of longer workouts like this where I add choreography, different formats, join the Fit Club. I'm posting below. We're having a lot of fun. June and July, we are staying fit through the summer. Join us. I'll put the link. All right, my friends, like this video. If you did enjoy it, subscribe to Workout Hotel. Share me with your family and your friends, especially in the summer when you're traveling. All right, let me know if you have any questions. I will see you all at our next workout. Take care, everybody. Have a beautiful day. Bye.